Hello, this is Abdullah Shehri. In research and design settings, researchers must vary the thickness of thin films to optimize device performance. In traditional materials deposition, we have to fabricate several batches of devices, each with different film thickness, which is time consuming and the result of experimental artifacts. High throughput techniques such as thickness gradient film can solve this issue. In this approach, produced thin film can vary across the substrate. The multiple devices can be fabricated at different locations of the film surface and compared in the same time, which is faster and more reliable result can be obtained and we can reduce the fabrication cost. A challenge of current high throughput techniques are most are vacuum based, need high temperature and difficult to produce thickness gradient in sub 10 nanometer range. For that reasons, we have developed our atmospheric pressure special atomic layer deposition system to deposit thickness gradient films. In special atomic layer deposition system, the substrate moves underneath the reactor to absorb the precursors and reactant. Uniform film can be obtained by using uniform reactor substrate spacing as shown in figure A. The thickness gradient film can be obtained by using different spacing to allow more mixing of gases at higher spacing than getting thicker film at higher space. This occurs by tilting the reactor head as shown in figure B or by tilting the substrate as shown in figure C. Uniform film is obtained by using uniform spacing as shown in figure 2A. Thickness gradient film are obtained by using different spacing as shown in figure B, C, and D. Different colors means different thicknesses. Figure E shows AFM measurements of thickness gradient across an aluminum oxide film. The thickness decreases from 10 to 2 nanometer across the, the substrate as shown in figure E. Finally, we study the effect of insulator thickness on the performance of metal insulator metal diode by introducing aluminum oxide thickness gradient as an insulator layer in MIM diode. As shown in figure A, the insulator thickness vary across the substrate and we performed and compared the current voltage measurements at different substrate locations. The results show that the current density increase with aluminum oxide thickness decrease as shown in figure A, B, and C. The figure of merit vary across the substrate as shown in figure D, E, and F. This study indicates that the optimum figure of merits for this kind of diode can be obtained with the insulator thickness of 6.5 to 7 nanometer. Thank you.